Now this is some fresh fruit to eat right here. Like the fruit, the vegetables, this is good right here. You go hoping, make sure you get the fruit, the vegetables, the good stuff, the water. No junk food, y'all, so after work, I'm about to head into work right now. After work, I'm about to do some laundry, drop my clothes off like I promised. And do some herping, all right? So I'll see you guys a little later in the day. All right, I'm out. Hey, what's going on, guys? So I just got from um, putting my laundry in. So we're going to see if we get some snakes. As I promised, this is the, this is the laundry edition. I want to show you like how easy it is to to just drop stuff off and just go grab some snakes because like it's it's perfect weather right now so should be no excuse for no snakes to be out right now at least God is in the case hopefully we get some milks but um I know something's gonna be out today it's like 75 degrees right now and it's sunny so nice cool breeze so we should get something good hopefully a milk or two you know I haven't seen them here in a while at this spot but um. You know, I'm having a good feeling about today. I'm thinking it's going to be good. I'm thinking it's going to be, you know, at least five, uh, hopefully, at least two or three milks, but hopefully more than that, though. I remember last last year coming around this time, I found like 10 milks at this same spot right now. So hopefully, I don't think we're going to do that today, but you never know. That's why you go out. That's why we go out. Go out and look because you never know what you're going to find. Sometimes people go out and find lifers and stuff, so you never know. Never stay home, always go out, even if you're tired from work or doing your laundry like me, just get out there, you know? I just threw my clothes in, it's washing right now, so let's see if we get some snakes, all right? So once I get to the first snake, I'll let you guys know, all right? I'll see you guys in a few. A few more goddess. Goddess chilling. I said I don't want to bother these guys too much, but it was good to see snakes out, out and about. Well, I flipped these guys, so that's cool. So, yeah. That's a pretty one right there. That's a different one than I flipped earlier. Well, I just flipped a little while ago. A different pretty one, so I'm gonna let these guys go. Up. Oh, he's going in the rocks, cool. I'm gonna let these guys go about their business and um, and see if we can find some more snakes, all right. Here's another one I just missed. So that's all, always check your cover thoroughly. That's the name of the game. Because I, I did that a few times. I remember I flipped a, a garter snake in shed. And then I went back to take more pictures. And there was a baby milk. So always check your cover thoroughly. Always make sure. Check every nook and crannies. And make sure you get all the snakes and all everything out before you put it back. Because you don't want to injure no animals. All right, nice, another nice little garter. Let's see what else we can get. I'm out. Yeah, I just wanted to show you guys that that the cover I laid out recently is paying off. Check this out, guys. Got a, got a big DK snake. Look at that. Cool. Cover is paying off. Like I told you guys, put it out in some good habitat. The snakes will be there. Yep. Nice size DK snake. And I'm not gonna pick them up. I handle hundreds, thousands of these guys. Just wanted to show you guys that the cover would definitely pay off. So, yep, cool. Cage brown snake. So all I need is a milk snake, and I find I will find today all three common species in New York City. So cool, the cage brown snake. And just put this cover down last week. Matter of fact, not not even a couple of days ago, I just put this down. Look at that. Look at that. Cool. So let's go to the next snake and I'll let you guys know when I've got the next snake. The DK's Brown Snake, New York City. All right, I'm out. Look what I found, a ladybug. I know it's not a snake, but I always say these guys bring me luck. It's the first, time, first one I found at this spot. So hopefully we should get a few more milks. Ladybug. Cool, 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 cool beans, man. Where's the milks at, Ladybug? Where's the milks? Lead me to the milks. 
Hey guys. So this is this is my official mascot. This guy don't move, man. <laughs> Every time I come here, he holds down the place. He's in the same spot, flipped under the same rock, which is cool. Because I have no problems with that, you know. I mean, I take him out, I put the rock back, because you don't want to smash him. Comes back the next day, he's back in the same spot. Like I said, which is cool, I have no problem with that. And I love to see the same look over and over. This guy is, is the best, you know. Nice bright red eyes, chocolate milk. But like I said, he's the mascot though. He holds down the place, he holds down the fort, you know. He's the team mascot at this spot, of course. This is cool. So it's like, I think this is the first time I've seen the milk in the same spot three times in a row in one year. This is cool, man. Man, I filmed him yesterday. I'm, I'm going to include that in the video. Cause, you know, I make I make I made two days out of it. Um, and he's back again today. So that is cool. So yeah, he's he's completely docile. I can show you guys. Look, see, my hands are right here. This is a milk snake. This is a wild milk snake. I'm touching him. He's not going to bite me. I picked him up the other day. Look at that nice milk for you guys. A big chocolate Easter milk. Now pop out this triangular. And um, that's it. And let him go. If I come back, I bet you he's going to be under the same spot. He loves this spot. <laughs> he can't get enough of this spot. It's cool. There we go. Go in your hole, little dude. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. So let's see if we get some more milks. But the milk mascot. All right. And I get the next snake, I'll get let you guys know. I'm out. Hey, what's up, guys? Got me a garter snake. Just flipped him just now on the rock. A nice, decent size, nice color. Decent, I mean, you know, normal garter snake. Not as pretty as the other ones I found. But, um, flip is a flip. So, I let this guy go and um, see if we get the next snake. Cool, so nice little garter snake. New York City. I'm gonna flip every snake I find because, like I said, everything is limited right now. So whatever I see, I flip. All right. I'll get back to you guys later when I get the next snake. All right, New York City. Cool. Good little tongue flick around. All right. Let's see what else we can get. All right, I'm out. Hey, what's up, guys? Just flipped this nice-looking garden snake. Damn, look how pretty this thing is. Get some focus. There we go. Look at that. That's a nice yellow colors. Yeah, I never seen one like this before. Yellow all over the place. This is real nice. It's a nice looking guy right here. Yeah. Yes, it is. Nice looking garter. Just flipped him just now. A little small baby garter, but some nice looking colors. For New York City, this is like crazy right here. We never, we never get nothing nice like this. Never, ever, ever. So yeah. I don't like this new um new phone camera I got. I think I'm gonna just go back to the original one. But um yeah, so let's keep on flipping and see what we can get. But so far, nice little garter, nice little look at that little, little head pattern, little point, nice and yellow. All right, so when I find the next snake, I'll let you guys know. New York City, I'm out. Hey, what's up, guys? Just flipped this nice, nice size garter snake, adult. Nice pretty garter snake. Stink. Yeah, just found a nice, nice garter snake shed, fresh. And maybe today, yesterday, last night, but this is just definitely fresh. It's still like still wet a little bit. Cool. Not a snake, but and then that's how you know with snakes in the area. When you see the sheds, you know the snakes are here. So let's keep looking for more snakes. But a nice fresh shed I want to share with you guys. I found milk snake sheds a lot as well. So this is a garden snake because I can see the line. You know, you can look, tell. It's only th three three major snakes here in this spot. Garters, milks, and decay. So this is this is most likely a garden snake. So and um in the future, which which is which mean is maybe June or August. Sometime I find a lot of milk sheds, so I'll definitely be sharing with you guys. So cool. So let's get to the next thing. Garters galore. Wish it was milks instead of garters, but that's how it is. 
Garters, good lord, look at that. Another garter. Another big garter too. Yeah, I'ma let you go. I'ma let you go. Don't worry about it. I'll let you go. Don't worry. Just flip this guy just now. So cool. So the garters are out in New York City. Like I said, most common snake and yeah, most major cities. You can find these guys anywhere. These guys are out, out do any snake. Water, maybe water snakes, maybe, but I don't know. I mean, Garters are everywhere, nothing special. He's got a nice head on this guy. Look at this, look at this head, it's pretty cool. Well, you know, I'll let him go. And let's film the next snake. See ya. New York City Garter Snake. It was like that, he's gone, gone in the flash. Yeah, see a big milk right there, guys. I wanna pull him out. I don't even have to look. That's a, a rock I see like guard is under. But there's a big milk right there, so let me pull him out and um, let you guys see. I don't, I'm, man, he looks huge. So I'm, I'm very excited. So let me see, let me see how he looks. All right, give me a second, guys. All right, what's up, guys? I got a, look what I got. A little small baby milk, yeah. Uh, I got, a, got him. It's kind of, there we go. A little small milk. Let it propel to triangle him. I'm not gonna tell you where I found him. Cool little spot for me, nah. But anyway, um, yeah. Like I said, the milk should be out today. And I got one, cool, a little small baby milk. So if you guys wanna see more of these milks, Hit the like button and subscribe because he just told me that if you don't hit the like button, he's you know he's he's gonna tell his friends not to come out. <laughs> yeah, cool. So, uh, that other milk I found yesterday was more cooperative. There we go. Some nice colors on his milk. So you know the small milks are, are beautiful. Well, all milks are beautiful, but the small ones are you know they're the ones that's like brightly colored and everything has more red and white. This one has a, like a burgundy color to him. And this is like last year's hatchling. You see, he got cool red eyes. Cool. You look at his underbelly, it's a checkerboard pattern. So even at, even at a young age, they still have the checkerboard pattern. You know, I'm filming with my new selfie I got yesterday. Those who saw the video, so I, mean, I got me a free selfie. Free selfie stick. So, yeah. So, yeah. See his belly? There we go. Cool. And this is New York City right here. I'm in the city. And um, a lot of people don't think we got cool stuff, but we do have Eastern milks. But it's kind of kind of whack because, like, for one milk, for, like, every five or six garters, you find one milk, but you can't complain. You know, garters, like I said, garters rule. You know, they give live birth, so, you know, more babies will come out. The milks lay eggs, so, you know. Yep, so Eastern milk snake. I'm going to prepare this triangle on I'm um, gonna try to find a couple more. Uh, got one for you guys right here, so, all right. So let me take some pictures and I'm gonna put them back when I found them. So let's get to the next snake. I'll let you guys know when I'm at the next snake, all right? Eastern Milk Snake, Lampa Purchase Triangulum, last year's hatchling in New York City. I'm out. Hey guys, what's up? Just fit another small milk. This one is beautiful. Look at this one. And remember what I told you guys, like, hit that like button. If the milks was telling me if you don't hit that like button, they're not gonna pop out. <laughs> but um this one is beautiful. Look at that one. Look at this one guys. Look at that. Look at the colors on this one. So I just flipped two back to back milks. Well the other one was on the crawl. This one I just flipped. Look at them colors right there, guys. So I'm showing you guys the best milks in New York City has to offer. And look at that, look at the head pattern on this guy. Look at that. So these are all last year hatchlings. I'm a, like I told you guys, this year started slow, but you gotta you gotta work hard for these milks, man. Like, you, I know you guys see videos of guys catching milks like it's nothing, but you really gotta work hard, man. These milks, you know, this this year, last year, I caught like seven milks, and, and like at the beginning of May, this is my only, it's my third small milk. I mean, this is crazy, like, but they out though, you know. I mean, because they know to come out, like they hibernate during the winter and they come out, like they have no choice to come out because they know. You know, by nature to come out. Look at the eyes. Beautiful red eyes. Look at that. Beautiful. So, and let's find some more milks for you guys. Cool. New York City. And I'm actually, yes, I'm in the city right now. I'm not in the, you know, I'm in the forest, but I'm still in the city. 
you know, I'm still in the, when I, once I leave here, it's still big buildings and, and chicken stores. <laughs> cool. Well, there you go. Eastern Mooks, man. He's a little more calm than the other one. The other one was all over the place, but they have, they, they have different temperaments. You know, the youngest was always bitey, but he's a cool guy. He's calm and very docile. You know, beautiful. You know, like you could tell. And, you know, most of them will lose that bright red and, you know, they keep the background pattern, some of them, the background colors, but see the saddles, see, see how the saddles are red? Most of them will lose the saddles as they get older, so. All right, well, I'm sure we're gonna find more, so let's not spend too much time with this guy. Take some pics and let him back on this rock. All right, New York City, Eastern Milk Snake. I'll catch you guys in a few. Hit the like button. It's a nice white striped garter snake right there. Just flip this guy, and if you look over here, it's a nice shed. Cool. So, snakes are out today. Not gonna bother this guy too much, but you're finding some nice garters lately. And better looking garters than the milks, which is a shame, but it is what it is. Season is slow for the milks. Hopefully, they'll come out soon. May and June is always good. I know it's the beginning of May, but. I thought I would find more. But, oh well. A snake is a snake. Alright, nice close up with the garter. And when I find something else, I'll let you guys know. New York City, herping while I'm doing my laundry. Alright, it's the next snake. Hey, what's up, guys? I got a decays, nice little decays. He shit all over me, but cool. Well, actually, it's not cool. Look at that. He crapped all over me. But this is one of the this is one of the cover pieces that I just put down a few days ago. And like I told you, I already got me a, a decays brown. I think I got a few decays, so that's cool. You know. So yeah. So these pieces are actually working out pretty good for me. You know. Cool. Got some garters. Got some decays. I had one milk last week, so hoping to get some more milks. But it's showing you guys that these little covers I'm putting out like. Instantly, it's, you know, it's paying off. So, it's cool. So, I'm going to put this guy back, take a couple of pictures, and be on my way. And see if I get some more snakes for you guys. Cool. The Case Brown Snakes, um, NYC, New York City, y'all. Cool. Cute little guy. A little small guy. All right, I'm out. Yeah, it got me a... This might be my last snake. I just flipped on one of these rocks. So I just met a family while I was out here, you know. So I want to I want to give a shout out to the B family, you know. They said they're going to watch my channel later. So I'm giving a shout out to, you know, to the whole family. Uh garter snake, nothing special, you know. Nice size, stink like crazy. But, you know, I got my glove on, but I'm going to just get rid of these gloves after I finish. You know I told you guys I wear the gloves because the garter snakes, you know, I'm I'm a um I'm slightly allergic to the, well, I get a slight reaction to the, you know, to their bite. So once, they, you know, once they bite me, you know, I itch, I swell, I get, you know, I, I get redness and stuff like that. So, you know, this might be my last flip of the day, but I'm going to keep on searching. But, um, you know, like I said, I'm going to get a shout out to the B family, you know. So I was like, I was like, you know, I just met them a few, you know, a few minutes ago. And I was like, oh, hopefully I get a snake so I could do a shout out for them, you know. So, you know, I flipped the garter. And hoping to find some more milks, but then I gotta, like I said, I gotta go hurry up, hurry up and go back and um, dry my clothes. So I'm gonna let this guy go, maybe take a pick or two. You know, he's, he's not a bad garter, not the best, but you know, I'm tired of garters. See him all the time, you know, you know. Wish you could see milks like garters, but you know, that's the rule of thumb. Like I said, for every five or six garters, you see a milk, so. Or for every, every milk, it's like five or six garters, maybe 10 garters, you know. Lately, it's been like 20 garters, so it's just crazy. Yeah. Yeah, so. All right, let this guy go and look for some more snakes. All right, I'll see you guys in a few. All right, yeah, I'm about to call it a wrap. So we got some milks. We got, I found the decays, but he, you know, he slipped through the rock. We got some milks. We got garters as usual. And you guys get to hear tree frogs on my way out, so that's cool. So we had a good day. Let me hurry, let me hurry back and get to the laundromat before they throw my clothes out. You know, you don't want that to happen. I'm watching my uniform. So we had a good day. Lots of snakes. And it was fun.
So thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe, and I'll see you guys on the next episode. All right? You guys take care. Be safe. Happy herping.